hey guys welcome back welcome back to our channel in this video let me share you how to switch desktops on windows 11 pc once i'm actually press windows plus tab key i can able to see like this so here only you can able to manage the desktops you can able to create multiple desktops by just clicking on this new desktop every time so now here is a desktop two three four like like that you can able to create multiple times and once I click on this work option, so now in this desktop, there is a separate uh, wallpaper will be shown and in what are all the application you are working. So that will be shown here. So currently I'm already in the, so film or paint application and the browsers are opened. So if you want to hide your work means, so then just click on the windows plus tab key and click on the desktop too. So now you entered into the new desktop and there no application has been shown as opened so that no one can able to know so what type of work you are actually doing and also so I am currently disabled to the task view option so there is a task view in the taskbar so for that you need to just head into the settings option so just to go to the settings here click on the personalization and here click on the taskbar now here is the option task view by default it is actually turned on only but i wantedly turned off this option because if anyone access your pc means they can easily able to access your second desktop so that's why i actually disabled if you want means you can enable it after enabled once you click on this task view option so you can easily uh, switch over the desktops without pressing the keyboard shortcut and also in the desktop so for example so if you face any issue like the wallpaper is not changing between the desktop means so in that condition what you can do is that just to go to the home screen and click on the task view and here just a right click on the desktop and here is the option choose background so use this type of way to change the background or to change the home screen wallpaper for each desktop then the wallpaper will be changed on the desktop so so now the wallpaper changed on this desktop so if i switch the desktops to work means now the windows default wallpaper has been shown in this way you can easily switch the desktops and also there is a one more keyboard shortcut just press windows plus control plus right arrow to immediately switch over to the next desktop once click on the left arrow it again backs to the previous desktop so like this you can easily switch over the desktops and also you can able to move the application from one desktop to another desktop so for that you have to just click on the desktop or you can just use the keyboard shortcut and here once you hover the mouse on any one of the desktop you can able to see what are all the application minimized on each desktop so if you want to for example if i want to move this paint application to the desktop two means just a right click that application and click on the move to and here is the desktop to click on that and if you want to create a new desktop also you can do that so for example there is a lot of sticky notes here so if i want to just uh, move any one of the notes when just a right click move to and here is the new desktop just to click on that now your new desktop created and in that desktop uh, that particular application has been moved and in the desktop too there is a two application we recently moved the paint application so like this you can organize your uh, work behavior by categorizing into different desktops like it's a work desktop and then uh, it's uh, for a personal desktop so here you can uh, open the chrome browser and you can search for personally and here is the desktop 3 it's for uh, another type of work like that you can organize your work by categorizing into different desktops on windows 11 pc well now in this way you can easily switch over the desktop between uh, different desktops on windows 11 pc well now that's it on this video guys and hopefully if you like this video hit the like button and if you are new to this channel subscribe to our channel below and thanks for watching this video guys